guys, check out the next level games for all your TCG needs. Link is down below in the description of the video. Thanks, guys. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the team. Fish Knuckles YouTube channel. Today is Fan Friday. And like I said, on I think like Monday or Tuesday, uh, today we're playing a Meganium deck. Uh, it's what one. If you don't know, let's go over the deck. And it's a pretty simple deck. We've played something like this before. But Meganium has that quick ripening herb. Once turn to turn, before you attack me, use this ability. Choose one of your base Pokemon to play. If you have a stage card in your hand, evolve that Pokemon. Put that card up to the base Pokemon to evolve it. You can use the ability during your first turn on a Pokemon that was put into play this turn. There we go. So that is what we're going to use today. It's a quick ripening herb. Um, What we can do is we can evolve into Nidoqueen, which has Queen's Call, which is pretty much what we really want to use it for. Um, You can search your deck for a Pokemon that isn't a Pokemon GX or GX. Reveal it and put it in your hand. You have Power Lariat. Um, and now with the new energy, you can pretty much just start attacking uh, for a ton of damage so quick because the triple acceleration counts as three energies and now you can do over 200 damage in a single turn with Nidoqueen. We got a very, very powerful deck uh, for sure, right? We got Swampert with the power draw. You can just draw three cards. Very, very cool. Um, nine tails for that mysterious guidance and a 1-1 one, one Tyranitar. Um, I guess for like lay the smackdown or something. Maybe death sleep. If your opponent's Pokemon is knocked out by damage from this Pokemon's attacks, put that Pokemon on cards attached to it to the lost zone. I'm not exactly sure why Tyranitar is in there. I guess like to lay the smackdown of nobody with a triple acceleration energy for 220 is kind of cute, I guess. Um, and then you can just ace roll it, of course. When it um, if it gets damaged, so I guess that's why it's in here, or maybe Dusty Ruckus. Um, it does thirty damage to each of your opponent's bench basic Pokemon. I guess I don't know. It's good. Like I, we're gonna lay this smack down with the deck. Everything else we know what they do, right? Uh, Elms to get your base Pokemon with sixty HP or less. That's why we're playing like the sixty HP um, Mudkip. Uh, we have Green's Exploration to search for to a po you know, of course, to search for probably the Swampert, maybe. And then draw and then get the Meganium. It's a lot of stuff happening, but we'll see, right? Um, Ninetales is good. So, you know, I, I, we know what the stuff does, right? Ace, like I said, you have an Ace Roller based deck, so maybe you pick it up for Nidoqueen so you get knocked out. I don't know. You're going to draw a bunch of Swamper. Nidoqueen's your attacker. Um, Tyranitar is cute, I guess. Um, the only difference in the Fan Friday deck is there was a reset stamp. Um, reset stamp is not legal in America, just to let you know. But. I don't know. We've played decks like this before. I think we could figure this out. Um, let's call it Nidoqueen. I think we already have one called Nidoqueen. Yep. Oh, it's not legal for some reason. We are missing a card, Josh. What are we missing? Uh, give me a second, and we'll be back today on Team Fish Knuckles once I find out what the card is. Okay. Alrighty. So the card we're missing was Palpad. Yay! All right. And of course, with like four Pokemon gear, we're gonna find our Pokemon. All right, let's try it again. There we go. Nidoqueen has been served. Oh, where am I going? Where am I going? All right, to, to standard land. All right, let's see if we keep the win streak. We have won four games. Uh, we're kind of feeling this out of order. If you fall, if you can follow along, what's happened this week? Um, if you're a fan of the, the the Team Fish Knuckles, you should follow along. Now, this might be where we lose our win streak. Uh, but we still got one more video to record, and that is Expanded Thursday. And this time, we've already seen Expanded Thursday. In recording time, we have not. Alrighty. So, if we see a six win streak on Expanded Thursday, surprise, you know how this first match goes. If you don't see one, who knows? But we're going first. Hopefully, we'll be able to have a six win streak for the week. That would be pretty cool. Uh, so we'll start with Nidoran. Yeah, we're going first. So we'll go Nidoran. We'll go Mudkip. We'll go Pokegear, try to hit an Elms, and then go crazy. I think that's the correct play here. All right. Jirachi. Okay, so we'll go here. Give me the Elms. Yes. My goodness. All right, so we'll go Elms. We will go Chikorita, Chikorita. Um, let's go second Nidoran. Okay. So let's go Chikor just in case I knock out one Chikorita, Chikorita, Nidoran, done. Oh my goodness, next time we get greens. Uh, oh well, we can't hit everything we need, but we'll find out. We get Rick Candy Meganium, and then we'll go from there, right? Is there, there's Timer Ball. We could go for Timer Ball, but we can guarantee it. 
Lily, no Guzma. That's nice. Hmm. The only problem is he has a Zapdos coming up. We really want to go after this peak and wrong because it's that kind of is going to struggle gets knocking out these like Zapdos and like these single prize attackers and stuff like that. Right? But if we knock out three of these guys and this guy, then we win. Like, right? Then that's the point. So let's get ready to rumble, Tapu Coco. I mean, I'm still feeling very confident, even though I'm kind of crazy right now. Hmm. Let's see here. Do we go? What do we? Do? Oh my goodness! Marshadow let loose, coming in clutch for my opponent. He doesn't even know how clutch that is. We have triple acceleration, greens, double swamper right now. And now we're getting a new hand of four. Wow. The, the hand is terrible. This is what happens with the hand. Oh my goodness. We're looking good, and now we look bad. I mean, we can Elms for a Bullpix, and that's... What does that card do? I've seen it before. Okay. So we're going to search for a Dedini, and maybe that's it. And just go crazy with Dedini. I think that's what you do here. I mean, if you get knocked out, we go like, ooh, that is not a Dedini. All right, they're planning to as like, we're going to take a knockout this turn. Oh, no, Dance of the Agents. And then he can Tapu Koko GX right now. Ooh, proud of you, opponent. You are so, are you so smart? But if we top deck away to take a knockout this turn, I'll be so happy. So, send me to Rant. I think we Elms and we just go from that way. I think that's the best play. Oh, my goodness. Nita ran. Our Vulpix is priced. That's good. Huh. Well, man. What's our other card here, Josh? Uh, I guess we just want to turn our deck out, right? So, yeah, we'll grab these. We'll go Nita ran. And a second Mudkip. The whole squad's here. We're squad up, but um, our hand is terrible. <laughs> the good thing about it, if we evolve, Skyhawk Claws can't watch up my, my Nita Queen. Who, do we go for Nita Queen or not? That's the question here. You know what? Like a wise man once said, you have to risk it for the biscuit. Today we are risking it, and oh uh, my goodness, this is what happens when you play this deck sometimes. My goodness. Well, we lose. Um, there's no way to come back from this. <laughs> Very nice. Well, we lost our win streak. Okay, so we had a way how we're going to do really good. And now we're, oh, well, there's a Nine Tails. That'd be really good right now. Uh, it's extra Poke Gear and other stuff. But nope, not today. Now the Lightning to Pikachu Zekrom. We might see a GX tag come out and uh, take two prize cards. You know what? There's no point. We're just we're, we're just going. There's, there's no point. Let's just go home. Let's just go home. We can't come back. All right, well... <sighs> If you, uh, <laughs> all right, round two. <laughs> so we found the downfall, right? The downfall is you play a bunch of Pokemon, and if you get Marshadow to nothing, well, you lose. <laughs> Xanthrax. Okay, great name there, bud. Uh, yes, I would like to go first. Thank you, sir, for playing. All right, so let's see. Can we get a win with this deck? Um, not when you draw like this. Not when you draw like We are going first. So, maybe we top deck an Elms? Like, there's a bunch of draw cards, kind of, right? Four Elms. Um, I mean, yeah, we went to Elms right now, but looking good. Nope, okay, well, we'll pass. <laughs> I mean, we can rare candy and then Queen and then swing. Uh, we can go Queen's Call. Oh, to search for a Swampert. Um, uh, this is Lost March. Interesting. I think we lose against these single prize attackers. I know it's early, right? It's early to say we lose, but the problem is we only play five energies. So we have to go for the Tyranitar play. That's the only way we really have a shot. I'm just letting you know this. That's, I mean, it might be obvious, but it might not be obvious, right? I don't know. This is a deck I don't think is really around anymore. Does it still handle? Can it handle, handle the Charizard decks? You know, everyone's really exci excited about this Lost March deck. And now it now pretty much has, like, disappeared, pretty much. Uh, so, we'll see what happens. I mean, 
He's not taking a knockout uh, right now. He's not weak to psychic, so that's the only unfortunate part. But, mm, I mean, if we top deck rare candy, so we go like, if we top deck rare candy, we're we are golden, right? No? Yes? Uh, no, we're not golden. <laughs> We didn't want it to be going in here, Josh. Oh, we won! Yay! We won a game with the deck! Whoop, 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 whoop! <laughs> Alright, well, whatever. Alright, we'll take that. I don't know what just happened because I definitely think that's in my opponent's favor. Well, there we go. Thanks for watching Fan Friday. Have a great day. Just kidding. We're going to actually try to play a game. Alright, click play. Alright, we're looking for opponent. Let's see here. What do we find today? A fire deck. So this is going to be Charizard, which, you know, going into Madison, which, once again, if you haven't followed along this week, I've recorded this before, Madison Regionals. Uh, Charizard was the biggest deck going into Madison, I feel like, right? I feel like that is 100% the truth. But we'll see what happens here. We shall see what happens. Uh, we're still mulligan. How did we mulligan so many times? Okay. Oh, we mulligan twice. Uh, which is, I mean, huh. can they knock us out here in one? Uh, yeah, there's this caller called Wilder. It's really good. But the most they can do is outrage, but they can outrage a Chikorita, which can knock us out. Huh. Okay, so breast done. Making a new hand here. Okie dokie. We mulliganed three times. How is that possible, Josh? Beats me. I have no idea. Hmm. So, man, we have a Green's Exploration, which, yeah, it can find us, like, some stuff, right? I mean, we are Mudkip. So, we do just one-shot this guy. No, we don't. I mean, Hydro Pump. Yeah, it does. It does. So, we can go Green's to find two Pokemon. So we'll go, hmm, let's see here. We'll go, oh, we can't, it's two item cards, Josh. So we need two uh, Nest Ball. Oh my goodness, we only get one Nest Ball. <laughs> and it helps. Okay. Yep. We'll go, man, does he knock us out? No, he can't knock us out. Go Chikorita. Okay, and we'll press done. So what we can do next turn is greens for a rare candy meganium. Get out meganium and just start going crazy. I think that's the best thing we can do right now. Uh, can you watch out a Swampert? Uh, yeah, are you kidding me? But yeah, with greens, did I greens for an Elms? Oh, for the following turn after, okay, yeah. Cause we, we greens this turn Find a red candy, Chikorita, Chikorita, Magani went to, you know, Swampert, okay. There's a Volcania coming down, okay. I mean, he's not taking a knockout, but he nest ball for Volcania, so he knows he's in trouble, right? I mean, we have so many outs. Um, The big thing he needs to target down is Chikorita. If he can somehow get the Chikorita knocked out before we evolve it, then it looks good in his favor. But if he can't, then we're looking good to go. Huh. Probably feeling discard Kakuian Fire. We're gonna get some fire energies. I bet he's playing the Greens build, that one of Santa Claire, or whatever it's called. Okay. So there's four fire energies. Alrighty. Man, we're definitely just gonna greens it. I mean, what if we top deck Meganium? Then we're golden. Alright. So, what I mean the whole time is I have to greens for, let me get this right. Uh, we have to greens for a rare candy and a timer ball. Yes, that is what we have to do. Okay, so greens of themselves, okay. I mean, right now they can use that, that fire, the flare starter. So for three fire, you can you one any way you like. So let's see, does he greens for a Reshizard, or does he go someplace else? Hmm, that is the question. So Field Blower and Heat Factory. Okay, Field Blower, that's an interesting card. Now, think about 
Hydro Pump, it doesn't actually one-shot Reshizard, right? You gotta remember that. Um, it, the most we can do is like 220, unless we go Super Boost. With Super Boost, anything is possible. So, <coughs> two to Volcanium, okay. So greens, rare candy, timer ball. Yeah, that's what we have to do here. <laughs> well, timer ball. Beautiful. We'll grab Swampert. Uh, no, not Swampert. Get that out of here. Meganium. Yeah, let's go into the Swampert. That seems fine. Okay. Well, rare candy meganium. Well, quick ripening herb into Swampert. Okay. Um, I'm gonna trade or power draw away the Nine Tails. I think that's fine for right now. Mudkip. Um, so we get the power draw next turn as well. Uh, so I'm gonna press done right now. What we can do next turn, if he does it knock us out, he only does 110, so he's not gonna knock us out. So we have some time here, so that's great. Um, we can like, Elms for a Nita Queen, McGain, or Chikorita, and then maybe another um, Nidoran, or Nidoran, Chikorita, Nidoran. We can click Ripening Herb, maybe into the Swamp, but we'll power draw first and see if we hit the other um, Meganium, and then maybe we get double. The only thing I'm scared about right now is if he knocks out Meganium, right? That would be terrible. But we'll see. Hmm. So discards of fire. Does he have Guzma energy? That is the question we are wondering, right? If he has Guzma energy, bye bye Meganium, you are toasted. Toasted, not coming back, you are gonzo. For sure. But if he doesn't have it, then he only hit 110. We get double power draw this turn, and then we can see a ton of cards. Yeah, I think we definitely Elm, so. So, Welder. All right, so he's definitely going to be very aggro, like, Volcanium, which is what I was, like, a little bit scared of. So we might have to go for Tyranitar GX and just go for the Dusty, the Dusty Ruckus, which is probably our best out to win this matchup. Just a heads up. So, Nest Ball. Well, this get the Reshizard. Because right now, oh, nope, another Volcanium. So he's going straight Volcaniums. Uh, which I think, yeah, a Dusty Ruckus might be what we have to do here. So another Fire to do here. He's only doing 110. He's not taking a knockout. If we find a Triple Acceleration and then take a knockout, that'd be nice. So on our turn, we find Guzma, which doesn't get us anything right now. So we'll Elms for three. We'll go Nidoran. Chikorita. Oh my goodness, of course it's prized. Um, there's none there either. So we'll grab a Vulpix and we'll probably just trade power draw that away. Okay. So we'll go Nidoran, Chikorita, Pokegear. I'm just sending my deck down. We can't use Green's Exploration anymore turn because we have, um, we can, you know, we have Pokemon's abilities now. So, Power Draw, discard the Greens, and we'll see what we get first. All right, so we go Quick Ripening Herb into the Meganium. We can go Quick Ripening Herb into the Swampert. Okay. Gladian could be really useful, but we can't use it right now. We're Power draw. Um, we discard the Vulpix drawn three new cards. I'm looking for another sw uh, sw little guy. Who we can go switch that. Yes. Let's we'll switch. Oh, I shouldn't. Oh, we can't attack with that. <laughs> Just kidding. Uh, yeah. Hydro for knockout. There we go. All right. So looking good. Go down to five price cards. Find a timer ball. That's not what we really need. I mean, I guess we could stretch her back in the 1-1 Swampert if it does get knocked out. Um, like the bench one. 
Because that's the only way you can really take a knockout. Unless he goes Kikui, but even Kikui doesn't even knock us out. So I think that's fine as well. Uh, what we can do is we can Stretcher. If he does go for Guzma, but he's he's Fire Crystalling, okay? That doesn't mean he has Guzma yet. That's good. Okay. Yeah, we can go Gladian for the Pupitar. Meganium into Tyranitar, and then we can start Dusty Ruckus in. Yep, that's what we're going to do here. And that is the game plan, for sure. So, second fire to the Volcanian. I mean, does he... Is he really missing Guzma by now? There it is. I was about to say, I'm like, my goodness. If he missed the Guzma again, that would be... Up, I'd be upset for my opponent. But does he have anything here? He's got to have another... It, Okay, uh, high heat blast. There we go. Oh, he only needs two energies, Josh. Come on now. Come on now. Learn your cards. So, send a Swampert. On to our turn. Okay, so we'll go... Um, Stretcher. Into our deck. Go one, two, and then the Vulpix, I guess. Doesn't really matter. <clears throat> well, Pokegear... Just to thin our deck down, we'll grab an Acerola, okay. We will Galadian. To grab a Lavatar. <clears throat> okay. We will He's not taking a knockout. He is not taking a knockout, that's what we're saying right now. So we'll go Professor Elms, draw on three. Okay. We'll go Larvitar, Quick Ripening Herb, into Tyranitar. We'll go Quick Ripening Herb, into Nidoqueen. We will Queen's Call for Mudkip. Okay. We'll put down Mudkip. A little Timer Ball. Dang it. Press done. <laughs> How upsetting. Like, we had this way cool combo, and now we missed it. Uh, I mean, we can still Power Draw. Hope to hit uh, the Super Boost. Or just a regular Energy. If we hit the regular Energy, then we can Ace Roll Up, blah, 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 Swamper, go crazy. And then we're good to go. Um... Yeah, I would love to go with Lady Smackdown, though. That's for sure. We also have Nita Queen now. That is another attacker we can use. Um, once again, it, none of these Pokemon are going to knock down. The only one that's going to get one-shotted is the Meganium. Um, that is a fact. So, have we just got a Palpat? We have not. That's another good card. Okay. So, I mean, we're looking fine here. I don't think he can beat us with just his Volcanian nonsense. He has to... Even if he puts down Reshizard, we are good to go. He can't one-shot any of my guys. Unless Meganium. Which he's used, what, one Guzma already? So there he is, Big Bad, Rishram, and Charizard GX has hit the field. He is here. He is ready to power up and go. But, I mean, Double Blaze is scary. And that is a fact, right? It could one-shot my Tyranitar GX. That might give him the advantage to win the game, um, right? Maybe put the Tyranitar down too early, but it is what it is. I guess we could have theoretically got a... Swamp it line, right? Oh well, it's neither here or there. If we hit a triple acceleration energy, we're looking good. We can watch out the stars out right now. Um on your bench. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. I mean we're gonna get the Pokemon out. We're gonna Queen's Call for a Swampert. I keep forgetting we have a Queen's Call, which will guarantee is a Swampert, and then we can draw seven cards next turn. If we don't find a way to one shot this Charizard, I mean I'm be mad at ourselves. Right? Oh my goodness, we hit it anyway. So we'll Queen's Call just to thin our deck down. We'll just grab a card. It doesn't matter. Okay. We will quick ripening herb the Swampert. Alright, let's start power drawing. So power draw, Chikorita, draw on three. Okay, we got it. <clears throat> power draw. Uh, we'll keep the Swampert. Mudkip seems very good. Uh, we'll discard the Rare Candy. 
All right, so 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Choice Man is enough for knockout. Uh, so Nidoqueen, make sure I put the right Pokemon. Guzma Charizard, send a Nidoqueen, attach a Choice Man. 250, Choice Man, 280. Seems like a really good deck. <laughs> okay, all right. So Nidoqueen, Nidoran, Jerry Pro Salvation, Galadian. All right, so we I mean, now we're good to go. We're good to go now. I don't think there's any way we can lose now. I mean, the only upsetting thing is, well, we have the Triple Acceleration Energy, which means a new Nidoqueen can take a knockout. If he swings, we can go like, if he hits my Nidoqueen, we can go like, Nidoran, Acerola, Switch, Knockout. So, like, you can see how strong this deck is, right? If you're playing against a GX EX deck, you're going to destroy them. I think you might even have an advantage against a non GX deck as long as they. Um... So, he's going to use my bring up that guy. It doesn't matter, I guess, because we got the triple acceleration energy. It will be our third one, but we only need one more prize card. So, I really want. You know, I really want to lay the smack down. I'm not even going to lie to you. I really, 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 really want to lay the smack down GX right now. I just, I just think it'd be really cool to do. Um, yeah, he's going to take a knockout, but who cares? Uh, we're going to lay the smack down. I'm sitting in Tyranitar. We're going for lay the smack down. That's all I got to say. Subarus is in here. It's here somewhere. We're going to find it. And we're going to draw seven cards. If we whiff it, oh my goodness. So another Restroom Charizard has hit the field. Uh, so unfortunately, we have to go to the Russian Charizard, I think. No, we're still going to lay the Smackdown. I want to lay the Smackdown GX. We, I mean, we won. We, we've won since this has hit the field. Because we have Guzma, Nidoqueen, this guy. We've won. We don't have Choice Band. Huh. A lot of ifs here. Well, you know what? Let's just go Tyranitar. Alright, so... Let's Queen's Call. Then our deck deck out, of course. So grab this. Alright. So we are other choice band is prized. Huh. So Nita Queen. We'll go here. Click ripening herb here to this guy. Surely do 260, which doesn't one shot it. Huh. Ah, I still just want to lay the smack down. Like, that, that's, that's all I want to do right now. I just want to lay the smack down. So bad. Just So let's power draw. Discard greens. Yeah, we only play one choice band, right? Yeah, one choice band. Should we get shrine? Um, I don't care about that, really. We'll power draw. Uh, discard the Gladian, please. Let me find the super boost. Oh my goodness. So we have to go Guzman, this guy. Oh my god, that's not, that's not fun. I want to lay the smack down. Whatever. We got this, we got this. Well, power layer for knockout. For 250, 260. I guess we could have just won. We could put down a shrine and do this, but I really no. Well, there's the deck. I mean, so you can see how strong it is, right? So you can one shot a, a Restroom Charizard because you have the Shrine of Punishment. Then you have the one Choice Band. Um, so you technically just need both of those, and you win. We did seven shin damage. This deck is crazy. Um, we see the problem though, though. You can get marched out into a bad hand, and then you just lose. But, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. I hope you had a great week of watching me play Pokemon. I don't think I made that many. I don't think I made really that many mistakes. Maybe this game, because I kind of forgot about uh, Queen's Call. But it's a really, really good ability. Queen's Call, I mean, this is all really good. It's a good deck. It's a really good deck. Hopefully somebody played it for Madison. It seems really good. Like I said, you only have five energies. And the bad part is, if you get a hand Pokemon, you lose. But, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Friday, and we'll see you Monday for Main Deck Monday. Alrighty, hit the subscribe button, and uh, yeah. Alright, bye.